Hi hello welcome back so today we will be seeing about chapter 13 disease of musculoskeletal system and connective tissue code series M00 hyphen M99 for the people who are watching my channel for the first time let me introduce myself I'm Danya CPC certified trainer mainly training candidates for CPC certification as well as basic medical coding training will also be provided so we'll start with the chapter for chapter 13 First, we have to know what is laterality. Laterality means side of the body is called as laterality. And second, your laterality in the sense right side or left side of the body. And sight and severity means sight means the anatomical area. Severity means um, like uh, the depth or the uh, like what to say. Severity is based on that. Okay. Next is bone versus joint. When bone versus joint is present for the patient, we have to code for the bone not for the uh, joint for that it is clearly mentioned here for certain conditions the bone may be affected at the upper end or lower end of the joint in this case we have to code only for the bone not for the joint so the next guideline is coding of pathological fracture pathological fra fracture are of two types you no know, traumatic and pathological traumatic means happening out of accidents and pathological is happening because of bone related disease condition so whenever you are coding for uh, pathological fra fracture make sure you are uh, giving seven characters okay so seventh character is very much important here the seventh character of the fracture codes include a for initial encounter of fracture, D for subsequent encounter with routine healing, G for subsequent encounter for fracture with delayed healing, K for subsequent encounter fracture with non-union, P for subsequent encounter of fracture with malunion, S for sequelae condition. For non-union and uh, non-union and malunion, you have to know what is the exact uh, definition of that. Next comes osteoporosis. Osteo means bone. Porosis means hole. So if hole is happening in the bone, that condition is called as osteoporosis. Whenever we are coding for osteoporosis, we have to check whether it is with pathological fracture or without pathological fracture. If it is with pathological fracture, code M80. If it is without pathological fracture, code M81. So, osteoporosis without pathological fracture. In this case, I told you already, we have to code M81. So, whenever we are coding for osteoporosis without pathological fracture, you have to check whether the patient have any history of healed osteoporosis fracture. If there is a history of healed osteoporosis fracture, then second code should be assigned for personal history of healed fracture. That is Z87.310. Osteoporosis with pathological fracture, you have to code M82. Zero. M80 should be assigned. Okay, next is so you will be coding M80 for that. So that's all about chapter 13. Thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't subscribed my channel, please do subscribe. And if you find it useful, please do share it with your friends also. And uh, please make a note of all the things, uh, all the guidelines, whichever is taught and make sure you are working out question paper for all these chapters. Then it will be easy for you at the time of CPC exam as well as for your interview. Thank you.